Good morning, or should I say, good afternoon. This week's vlog is going to be so different from my last videos. I'm actually doing something this week, surprisingly. We got his birthday tomorrow. And I am going to Scotland over the weekend. I have literally wanted to go to Scotland for so long like I'm so excited growing up in Canada Scotland's been like this really far away land that I never thought I would visit my entire life and the fact that it's literally like right there and it takes like not even a few hours to get there blows my mind still I'm going up with school we're doing like some sort of field trip I don't know what the field trip is but I'm probably not gonna vlog a lot of that I just wanted to vlog like going there because I'm going up to Glasgow first and then I'm gonna be like traveling to another city from there and apparently they have a freaking Tim Hortons dude like what? I feel like crying. So Francesco's actually coming tomorrow. He's just gonna like house it for me. I haven't seen him for like 10 months. I know a lot of people are gonna be like, ooh, ooh. But no. I'm really excited to see him. I'm excited to see his reaction. <laughs> Let me see him. So I have to go shopping today. I have to go get a rain jacket. Apparently it's gonna be raining the whole time. I have to get some rain boots. I have to get bug repellent because my grandparents were telling me they have these things called midges, which are worse than mosquitoes. I don't know what could be worse than a mosquito, but apparently they're really small and they just go crazy and swarm you and they'll just bite you all over. I gotta get food for him and let's go shopping. Oh yeah, by the way, I have completely forgot to mention. Oh, I haven't even put on my stick on yet. That's not what I was gonna say. I was gonna say my name is listed on the National National Natural History Museum's website. Hold up. That's right, bitch. I've infiltrated the Natural Fucking History Museum. I was asked to do an interview about this video because they just came across it and they like really were struck by it it's a it's a little bit embarrassing i'm not gonna lie because they included a lot of clips from that video where i was crying so it sounds like i'm crying during the interview but it's it's from the video and i just kind of sound like this nervous wrecking ball compared to like these other scientists and stuff that are actually interviewed in there as well so i feel a little bit out of place but at the same time Time. I'm just like really grateful because when I made that video, I didn't really think it was gonna go anywhere I don't know just the fact that like that video reached someone and that person was able to broadcast that message to a wider audience Like I don't know. I'm just really grateful I'm like um, so yeah If you guys end up giving it a listen keep that in mind that I am very nervous and I'm very awkward But yeah, have a look at it change of plans. They don't have any food in stock at the I gotta wait till tomorrow. So I'm going to keep this in this cute little hairstyle for tomorrow. But today I'm gonna just go back to my pajamas and just like start cleaning. <laughs> so I just picked up. Francesco from the train station. He's just washing his hands and he's gonna see Carl for the first time in months. <laughs> Leave me alone, I'm warning you. In his face, he's trying to avoid eye contact. Get your filthy hands off of me. <gasps> Rude! Oh, he, he swerved you. Let's go, little boy. Oh, do you remember who that is? I do, and I don't care. Look what Francesco's mom drew me. This is so sweet. Like, how talented is your mom? Look at this highlight. She even, like, did the highlight that I would normally do. Hi, Grazie mille, Tina. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> did it lick me? Yeah. <laughs> Come here, Mr. Waffles. Stop sleeping. <laughs> Waffles, where are you going? Hello, I missed you. No. <laughs>
What's wrong with you, buddy? chirping and I woke up like five times last night so I'm a little bit tired but when I get to Glasgow and I have the Tim Hortons everything's gonna be okay I didn't really vlog a lot yesterday because me and Francesco were just catching up but we spent like five hours yesterday shopping because it's gonna be really cold and I'm gonna have to be outside most of the time so I found this cute little yellow jacket and then I got these boots I feel like I look like the little boy from it. All of my friends say, girl, you better take care. Cause that man is trouble, you best beware. And load it down, I know I might be headed for teardrops. Now that you got me started, I just can't stop. No, no. Cause I love you, baby. I can't let you go. Okay, so I've just cut down in Glasgow and I'm so excited. I'm gonna try to find the Tim Hortons because apparently it's like literally right beside the train station. I got here really early so I have like an hour and a half or two hours to spend until my train. So I'm gonna spend two hours over here. So cute. My Tim Hortons spider senses are tingling that it's over here. I see it. Oh my god, there it is. Oh, oh my. I just take a minute to appreciate this because I don't think people realize what this means to me right now. Okay, that's going immediately in my bag. Dude, they have the French vanilla. Oh, yeah. Okay, so I kind of went a little bit crazy. I spent 20 pounds at Tim Hortons, but I had to. I got a apple fritter, an extra large ice cap, got some French vanilla, and I got myself an everything bagel with cream. Oh wait, no, that's the fritter, that's the bagel. But look at this. It's like the best view too. I'm getting another one before I fall. Oh my god, that was so good. Wow, I haven't had them. I could literally stay here for two hours while I wait for my train. This looks cool. What is this? Sloan's Bar and Bistro. Ooh, let's go down the alleyway. This looks cool. So I just came across this house. It says it's a Glasgow landmark, the Tobacco Merchants House 1775. I don't know what that is, but I'm just walking down here because I see like this little monument in the distance and I kind of just want to see what it is because we're in Scotland. Oh, I'm gonna get pooped on. No! Well, that's just rude. There's even a seagull pooping on him. I feel bad for whoever that guy was. <laughs> Again? Who's doing this to all these people? Is this a Scottish thing? Let me know, because from a Canadian's point of view, it looks hella disrespectful. Who is this guy? Is this the same guy? Sorry, man, they really don't like you. Scottish water? 
Oh, I have some filler. Mmm. There's Loch Ness Monster. Hold up. Why is no one freaking out about this? Who? Oh. It's just a duck. We on the lookout for the Loch Ness Monster while we're out here. Yo, how weird are these Scottish crows? <laughs> is that a crow? Hey, buddy. I'm kind of scared of him. He's coming so close. Oh my god, you guys. Either that's a plastic bag or that's a big ass jellyfish. Oh my god, so cool. That's a big one. Look at him just doing his thing. Dude, there's a dolphin or like something or Loch Ness Monster over there. Can you see it? There was this thing like jumping out of the water. are paper thin and it's six in the morning like you can actually literally hear everything everything i heard someone puking this morning i got here at like four o'clock yesterday and when i got here i literally just crashed i was so tired <laughs> when everyone came like we met in our groups and then and after dinner they did like these talks and um, you know how I was saying that I saw a dolphin on the ferry or I thought it was a dolphin? It was a dolphin. One of the workers was saying that they saw it on the way here. That was really cool. We saw a dolphin, bitch. I can show you the room. I'm not gonna lie, the room makes me feel like I'm in like some camp or something. Ooh. But I'll show you. So this is my setup. I started editing my video because I didn't have anything to do this morning. This is the bed. It's more comfortable than my bed. <laughs> There's another bed here. There's supposed to be someone that's sharing with me, but because of COVID. Do you guys want to see my view? It's of the car park. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah, this is it. And this is the washroom. We put my stuff in there. I love it. Life is a winding road No telling where it goes Driving through days and nights Won't stop for traffic lights And I I really wanna know, really wanna know If I Will ever figure out Falling down, I will keep on searching for my highs You can say I lost my mind, I will keep on holding my head high It's 5 in the morning and we're gonna go look outside and go for a walk Good morning guys, so it's 
like 6 40 in the morning i'm just going to do my makeup and then have some breakfast and then i'm going home today to little carl i, I see your smile in the morning light and girl every time i I just got home. I'm gonna see if Carl recognizes me or cares. Carl! What's you do? Oh no, it's you again. I was hoping you left for good. <laughs> he doesn't care. He doesn't care. Carl, I've been gone for five days. Five days is too short. It should have been forever. What is going on? Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh. So rude. Oh my god. I'm his favorite tree, I no. told you. I hate you both, but I hate her more. Carl, what day is it today? No, it's not today. Oh, I mean a couple days ago. <laughs> but we forgot to sing to you. Please don't. I think the poo smell is your breath. So for Carl's birthday, he got some more plants. So we gave him a cheese plant. I would love to say that I bought this for him, but it's actually just Albert. I just put Albert in here. 